in this lesson we'll add the rocker panel to the car. So it's just a little piece down on the bottom that we're going to be uh, going to be adding in here. We can see what that looks like uh, right in here, okay, and right in there. So the first thing we need to do is just add some resolution right along that line there. So again, go back, select an edge, select the ring, and let's go ahead and just add using connect, add an edge, and we'll slide it along till it's kind of right where we want it to be. Okay, say OK to that. Now we are going to go ahead and add some thickness to this. And now if we look at it, we can see that in this case, I'm going to go ahead and just actually take these polygons here. Okay, so this one, this one, this one, and this one, and then all the way up to the front. Right in there. Okay. And let's go ahead and just detach these polygons. Go ahead and detach those. Call this something like rocker. And then we can take that, add a little bit of thickness by using our shell modifier. Okay. We can add some inner, and let's also add a little bit of outer to this. Okay, so something like that. And we got a little bit of resolution in here by using our our number of segments. We go ahead and collapse this. Convert that to an editable poly. And let's select the edge ring. And just add a little bit of resolution in there. A couple of segments and just pinch those out. All the way to the ends. And then let's go ahead and add again a segment right on the end here just a one segment and just slide that out to the end and we can say okay to that okay and then we can go ahead and smooth this up you could also if you didn't want to uh, detach that you could also just clone it because it's sitting kind of right on top of that uh, existing geometry so that would be uh, another way to go. Okay. And if I turn that off, you can see that we now have that kind of panel there. And you can make it, if you wanted to make it a, a little bit wider, you could do that just depending on the amount of uh, the amount of uh, offset you give it in the shell modifier. All right. So now that we have the rocker panel cut out, We've added some resolution to that. We've created the thickness using our shell modifier. Now what we need to do is actually uh, finish out, let's go ahead and finish out the back end. Um, so we can come in here and mirror some of this across, do some modifications on here, also the trunk to get some of that detail worked out. And then we can actually come in and cut out the door. So we've got the front part of the door defined. We need to define the back part of the door and actually cut that out. And we can do that now that we've got this cut out because we wanted this to be kind of a, a single piece here. Okay, so we'll kind of move around a little bit, come back and forth. In the next lesson, though, we're going to come back here and do a little bit of work on the back end. So we'll add kind of an area for the license plate and also kind of a little light up here in the trunk, the top of the trunk. And then we'll come in and add some uh, exhaust pipes in there as well. So uh, we'll get to that starting in the next lesson.